Man, walking on the beach out here is really nice. The sand is really soft and the water is really warm. And there's just so much things. And there's just so many weird things happening right in front of my eyes. There's guys crab fishing. There's a guy that just rolled up in his scooter onto the beach. What's going on? Catching little fish. Oh. Oh, they catch a little fish. Little tiny fish. Oh! They're gonna eat that later. Every little counts. Yeah. Crabby, let's help go. them get back into the ocean. Go, go, go the other way. Go, that's the wrong way, Crabby. Here, I'm gonna help, I'm gonna help him. Tosses that. No, I don't wanna hurt the guy. You gotta get back in the ocean, Krabby. I'm gonna eat you in a minute, that's why. Danny's asking where to go. Look at these little doggies, man. Come here. Come here, puppy. Come here. That's a good baby. That's a good baby, man. That's a good doggy. They usually put the food out here, but because the weather, the storm, they had to bring all the food over here. When they catch it is that the here. same business right there same, same business. you've been here before yeah i've been here before look at the dogs are following us dude that's so dope they're like puppies they look so cool dude i know that's the thing with all the dogs out here they're so uh well mannered i don't know why like they're not even trained but they're just chill oh, right they don't they're not wild yeah all right so this guy just brought us to his seafood restaurant it doesn't get any more realer than this man he was catching this right there and he brought it over here and he's like we got crab we got fish we got clam we got clam oh my god they're gonna just set up a table in the middle of nowhere and then he's gonna cook us some uh, fresh uh, food that he caught this morning fuck all right the only reason why it's not over there, usually it's over there, but they have this big storm that came. Oh. So they, bring, they brought it. So they usually over set here. all this up here? Yeah, yeah. And is this the same guy you ate from last time? I think it's his wife. This is probably his cousin or oh. something. But he's, they're, they're really good. All right. Hey, whatever I could do to support the pups, I'm all good. Come back. Come here, baby. He's my friend, man. This is my friend. You trying to bite me? Just a good friend. This is our seafood restaurant for lunchtime. They're gonna set up a nice little table right there. We got the greeters here. Hi, greeters. They're so cute. We have our chef right here. He's getting ready. I guess they're all prepping. So the thing about this place is, since it's so low maintenance and they just kind of pop it up like this, it's dirt cheap and um, they catch everything fresh every morning because there's no way they can store it. So they wake up early as hell, they go out on their boats, they grab all the stuff that they need for the day, they bring it back and then they set up shop. Usually it's across the street, like Danny said, but there's like reports of a storm coming. So what ended up happening was they were like, I wanna stay safe from the possible storm and rain and I'm just gonna set up here just in case there's no business for today. So what we're waiting for is all the other crew to come in and just set up all for us. This is pretty cool. All right, she busted out with the crab. We're gonna eat some blue crab, baby. What else are we gonna eat, baby? Damn, we got some blue crab here. She's literally just setting up our whole system right now. I was wondering where she was gonna cook all of this. And out of there, she pulled out of the tarp just a straight up whole system. This is more realer than real, Danny. What the hell? Hey man, this is real life. I love this, dude. This Vietnam, dude. I love the fact that you lived here for like 15 years and you can give me the real local shit. No one's gonna give you this tour, I swear. This is the best tour. Or ever. you gotta risk dying on that. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, we picked up some fruits from some lady over. We're gonna eat this for dessert. I don't even know what kind of fruit this is. But that's jackfruit. We've been eating a little bit of this. And I don't even know what that is either. Uh, sorry? Sorry? Sorry. It's called sorry? Sorry. Okay. 
Oh, look at that. Is that the kitchen? Yeah, the kitchen's oh, coming. Oh, shit, dude. They're setting up this whole restaurant just for us. You mean, what if we're their only customers for the day? Uh, and I highly doubt that. They, they, they should get a lot of local customers. This for is, dinner? This is, more this is more for the locals. Yeah. Um, obviously, the restaurants here, they need to make a living. So they have uh, in stores, but this specific one, they don't have a store. So the prices are so affordable. I mean, I don't know how much it is, but we're gonna figure out. I like that we're supporting locals too, because for me, it's not about like cheap. Like, I don't really care if they rip us off, because even if they rip us off, it's still, it's still like a couple dollars more. Exactly. And I'm not even gonna bargain with them, but I love the fact that I'm supporting local. Um, and especially a guy that doesn't have, or a whole family that doesn't have a storefront. Mm -hmm. And they do this fresh. And it's like the guy in the front that you found. Yeah. It's crazy because you were just asking him where this food stall is. Mm -hmm. And the insane thing is Danny, like several years ago when he was filming the Vietnamese Bachelor, they ate here. And it just so happens to be the same booth. So the first guy we ask is the family member of the same booth that <laughs> yeah. you ate with. Exactly. Yeah. Small world. Small I know. World. It's cool, man. I like how they're fucking setting this all up. This is badass. Thanks. The little girl is the waitress? Pretty much. It's a family affair, man. Dude. They just brought up the fucking chopsticks. They got all this ready for us. Oh my God, dude. I love this. And the, the air, you you gotta talk about the air. It's, it's so fresh right now. Yup, over in the city, it's really smoggy, but over here, it's really calm. The freaking, you see the palm trees in the breeze? It's really nice, right? And it smells fucking amazing. It's just so many smells, like fruits and flowers and ocean breeze. And man, this is, this is really paradise. This is nice. They got straight up buckets of ice. But I don't know, should we eat this one? Yeah, it's fine. Fine, fuck it. That's the thing, man. I haven't gotten sick out of nothing yet. So fuck it, dude. Go hardcore. I don't give a damn. Exactly. That's how you clean your hands out here. That's it. The cool thing, too, is we, <laughs> we do have wet naps. So travel hack, uh, I recommend anytime you're in Southeast Asia, run around with some tissue for your butthole and wet naps because not everywhere has napkins and stuff like that. Ooh, oh, lemongrass. Man, this is her kitchen right here. Oh my goodness. Those are live clams, baby. The garlic. She's so smiley. She just made a clam salad. What is this? This is uh, lemongrass. And Woo! <laughs> yeah. What are you doing, Danny? We're getting Vietnamese with it. Damn. Cheers, do it. Cheers. Just eat and throw on the ground. Throw it on the ground? Yeah. Alright. Yeah. That's the way we do it here. We eat and you throw it on the ground. Mmm. Oh my god, that is fucking good, dude. Why is it so damn good? Why? Oh my god. Okay, so the lemongrass brings out this freaking lemony flavor. There's chili. And the natural sea is just fucking making this. Mm. It's so fresh. I never had clams this delicious before. Bam. Mmm. Everyone tells me don't drink the ice. Fuck it, homie. Mmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. More high bye, yo. More high bye, yo. yo. way to do oh here we go that's good dip that in the sauce mm. oh what is the sauce man lemon pepper that's some good ass sauce here we go nanny says i should drink the soup oh damn that's like seawater soup right there <laughs> that is so good i want to take that home with me oh Shrimps for the pimps. Damn. That's how you do it. Mm. Hot. Is it hot? Yep. Hey, is that like some ketchup sauce? Yeah. Sriracha? Pepper. Pepper. It's good. 
That lady's hooking it up. Yeah. She busted out, dude. All right, you gotta do this and show me how to eat it. All right, so very standard. You pull the tail out. Yeah, this little piece right here. That's the crab dick, dude. Oh, really? Yeah. You want That's crab dick. Oh, really? Okay. The way you tell the difference between a male or female is the male is a triangle and the female is a is a half circle. Oh shit, I didn't know that. That carries eggs. Oh, and a cool. Okay. <laughs> there it is. Okay, that's all the good stuff. Don't go that away. Yeah. So I want to put a little sauce in there. Right. Usually, we throw that part away. You can eat that? Not in Vietnam. <laughs> you don't let none of that go to waste. No, nope, this is all protein. Look at that. Damn. What do you do with the legs and stuff? Do you eat that? Just chew on it, I think. I mean, nothing goes to waste. All right, so you crack it open. Oh, shoot. Ooh, egg. Oh, yeah. There's eggs in here. Oh, my God. That is good. What the fuck? You used to throw that away? Yeah. Oh, no. That is good, bro. Mm -hmm. Here, I'm going to use a spoon of yours. Yep. Family bucket, man. Mm -hmm. Take it. Mm. Beautiful. Mm. And then from here, you just kind of... Yeah, just gnaw on it. Just break it up and eat it. All right. Mm. Wow. Yeah, it's breaking in half. There you go. Dude, that one's a good one. Oh, yeah. There's little pieces right there. God dang, I love seafood, man. I love seafood so much. You don't even, the thing is you don't even need any flavor. You could just go straight. This is just straight up. So damn delicious. Mmm. Whoa, last but not least, the clams, the red clams. Mmm. 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 Oh, that's so good, dude. It's like smoke. She actually baked these on mm. open fire. Yeah. Mmm. And they know how to cook it to where it's not overcooked and it's like cooked to perfection. Oh, what? It's got peanut too. Oh. What did that's she say? Oh, dumpling. Okay. okay. There's peanut. There's fried garlic. God damn. <laughs> mm. Mm. It's good. Come on. Come on. Come on. So the total is five hundred and twenty thousand dong, which is about twenty-two dollars. Okay, and back home, all of this seafood easily will be like. I don't know, $80, $100? That's a lot of money. So what me and Danny decided to do was just double it up and give her a million. So that'll make her day. We were talking to her and she said she gets about two customers a day. They don't eat as much as our fat asses. Mm -hmm. So, um, and she she uh, she was nice enough to tell us, don't eat fruit after you eat seafood. I don't know why. Here I am eating it. Yeah, but uh, we're gonna wait till later to eat that. But yeah, I don't know. A lot of people are against this when you give them more money than they're supposed to because it messes up the market and then they expect a fuck ton more from tourists yeah. and, and then the locals uh, can't afford it anymore. But I think this is a special case because Danny has rapport with this lady yeah. and their friends or he's eaten here before, gave him business, business before. So um, let's just, yeah, double it up and give her a million instead of, yeah. The fact that she came out here knowing that the that there might not be customers when we came, she took out all the. I think that's fish. what makes me feel bad yeah. the most is, yeah. is that she set up everything just for us super early. She was taking a nap, 
And it was so funny because I was like, are you sure, Danny? They're gonna set this shit up. The guy that we stopped over at the beach told one person, told another person, woke her up. She came on with her husband and her fucking kid. They all helped set up. So I was like, man, that's a lot of love and, and labor. So, uh, you know, why not make her day? That's right. Yep. Let's do it. It's nothing. All right. <laughs> it was delicious. Thank you. Okay. Come on. Cheese for my birthday. Chucky, chucky, chucky cheese for my birthday. Chucky, chucky, chucky cheese for my birthday. Chucky cheese for my birthday. Birthday. Chucky cheese. Birthday. Chucky, chucky, chucky cheese for my birthday. Chucky, chucky, chucky cheese for my birthday. Chucky cheese for my birthday. Birthday. Chucky cheese.